<laughs> would you say that you was the one after a certain point that was pushing it or was he the one that was pushing no. it? No. When y'all did talk about it, mm -hmm. what was that conversation like? When I tell you that, I, I appreciate you, Marcus. You like, know you it. changed your lives out here. Hey, man, I, yeah. I received that, all right? And the reason why it stopped with your brother at 10 was because... My grandmother walked in. And it was dark in the room, and I was like, look, I know what you did to me. And he just looked at me, he paused, and immediately he cried and he said, What's up, YouTube? I want to once again thank everybody who comes up to me in the streets and shows me real love. Y'all don't even know. It keeps me thankful. It keeps my tank full. Now, back to the content. What's up, YouTube? Atlanta Street Interviews out here with an update. So, you didn't look like this last time. <laughs> I didn't. You got your hair and everything going on. <laughs> okay, so, first and foremost, um, so this is an update. So, what's the burn mark you got right here? Um, when I was two years old, um, I was at a babysitter's house and hot water fell on me. And, you know, so the devil been at me since I was young. Literally. Literally. Wow. Literally. And it missed my face, so, you know. Okay. You know what I mean? So, <laughs> okay, <struggle> okay. <laughs> I get it, I get it. All right, so, you know, some of the people, so the way that, either the algorithm works or the way that my my audience works right okay. certain looks get certain clicks on videos right Absolutely. so i'm thinking that maybe this one will get a little more so we're going to revisit some of the stuff you talked about okay? okay okay um so one of the main threads in your story was that you basically wanted at one point wanted to marry your brother correct because i guess y'all were having sex and everything else yeah so remind me what age did that start that started at 10 you know, um, I, I have to, like, remember that my dad, my real father was never there. So I was always looking for somebody. So when that happened, I latched on to him because he was giving me what my dad, you know, you know what I mean? Like, he was giving me what I felt I needed. And so was it like, was it just sex or was it like y'all would, like, hang out and do this and so, do that? Or? you know, with this, yeah, yeah, oh, yeah, we would hang out. Of, of course, he's my brother. He would hold my hand. That's where the marry came in. I'm like, I want to marry you. You know what I mean? Like, <laughs> that, so, that's what do. So he would be like holding your hand and do of that course. type of stuff. Yeah, being protective. And would would he have any girlfriends around this time? Nah, I never seen him. With a and, oh, and let me ask. So it started at ten. What age did it go up into? Um, uh, no, I'm sorry. Let me. Remember. It started at eight. It stopped at ten. Okay. 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 Sometimes with your trauma, you just suppress it so much. Yeah, I get it. I, I got get pregnant it. at thirteen. So okay. there was there was a break. You know what I mean? Like he was always that brother figure. You know what I mean? Like, um, and this your biological brother, right? I, yeah, definitely. Okay, okay. Same mom, same dad, or no, no, different same dads? mom. Okay, different dads. With that being said, different dads. And, okay. and I, like we said, we're gonna get a little deeper. And when I get a little deeper, his father, my mom, and that's how he was brought about. So it gets wow. deep. It, wow. It, it really gets deep. It, it okay. really okay. gets deep. Okay. Okay. So, okay. How yeah. much older is he than you? Whoa. Um, the brother next to me is 46. He's the second oldest, so he got to be close to his 50s. It's not 51. And I'm 43. And you're 43, so Correct. that means when he was, when yeah. when you was eight, he was 16. Correct. That's why I like older men. You get it? <laughs> yeah. Wow. Yeah. Um, Makes sense. <laughs> because I mean, that's wildly illegal too, though, right? Crazy illegal. That's Crazy. that's wild. But I must say, like you know, cause there's other things that were you know, done, and, and I enjoyed it, too. Well, what but, were the other things that were like done? Like oral, and, and I enjoyed it, so... I, he I would know, do oral like, to you, or correct, you would do it to him? Correct, No, 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 well, yeah, yeah, I was made to do it to him, too. But the thing is about it, it was like, I don't know, it was just crazy. So you're saying that at, like, 8, 9, and 10 years old, he would do oral to you, and mm -hmm. you would be enjoying it and everything correct. else? I had a sensation, like, it's crazy. And so that's... That's Would you like fine. orgasm and stuff like that? I don't know what I did. I got my markers. I really don't. Yeah, I know. Just I, looking I, back on it, though, yeah, right? I, I was doing. I, I, like I said, I enjoyed it, so I, I was getting some kind of. Like, Would you say that you was the one after a certain point that was pushing it, or was he the one that was pushing? No, it? No, I was. Listen, I was submissive. Um, I like you know what? It, it, it was just like we were honestly like as an adult looking back, it's like we both were thrown in. And, and I'm adding him, and I'm not. I'm not betraying anything because later did I find out? Oh, his father, my mom. So damn, maybe it's in his like in his bloodline, but it's also taught. So that's why you know when I see you today, the the beautiful thing of this is he he wants to be a part of my life and be a part of my success. Because again, I'm in school, and he knows I'm homeless, and he wants to. You know, I went to Montgomery, and um, his neighbor told me. So that, he lives in Montgomery. Correct. Okay. And his neighbor said that he didn't want to see me 
And I actually went and I like I tweaked out. I really I lost it. Um, and you know my other brother. How did his neighbor know that he didn't want to see? Because they were close, but yo, know, his neighbor. It, 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 back to the matter is this: it was a whole bunch of bu bullshit because I wanted to sleep with his neighbor. That's why. I, that's where that. So the neighbor from. wanted to sleep with yeah, you. Yeah, <laughs> he wanted to sleep with me. He wanted to get his rocks off. So he wanted to destroy my relation. Like that. This is how the world is. He wanted to destroy my relation. The, the healing relationship that I'm trying to um, develop with my brother. Um, it took my other brother to tell me that that's not said, and and my brother actually wants to help me off the streets. And, and did you hear it from his mouth? I haven't. I haven't even reached out to him yet. <laughs> so wait, you haven't reached out to him? No. no so let's let, so let's back up real quick. Let's back up real I quick. So out. I don't know. Have have, have have y'all talked about the stuff that happened when y'all was Absolutely. kids? Absolutely. I went to like I've always walked around and been like, how the this man like I'm always real with myself you know what I mean since I was a child like so I, I know what happened I know you know what happened and and in our family was done in the house and swept under the rug what was done to my mother was swept under mm -hmm. the rug yep. you know what I mean like yep. at a time I was looking at her like how like how don't you know but she she didn't know because she was in the household until it was brought to her attention but nothing was done about her situation she was told she had to keep it I get it. so with with that being said like my brother never felt a part of the family. So, after my mom died, I had a no-knock policy, and it still stands today. Um, because I wanted him to feel a part of. Like, that, like, it's a blessing to be able to give to somebody what they choose not to give to me. Instead of murdering him. You know what I mean? Like, my first... What age were you when y'all had that conversation? 36. And I was living with him. It was the most hardest thing you in the world. You was living with him? I was living with Yo, when I tell you, Marcus... I was like, I ain't. So I'm, I'm gonna ask, right? Yep. Were y'all having sex? No, no, not at all. Okay, okay. No, so no, 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 not at all. Not so at all. when you talk to him about I, it, let, let me tell you this. Okay. He has never touched my children. It has never been brought up again. When I tell you, when I brought it to him, he was very sincerely like, "That's not who I am." Like, I'm getting goosebumps when I say that. You know what I mean? Like, mm. he, he. That's why I want to enjoin him in on this because he was hurt, and it, yo, I, I don't even understand what he went through, and I'm not dismissing what he did but there's no way in the world that my brother just was like come here let me let, let me play with your pussy and no he, he something happened to him and i want to be able to help him through it well i mean could it just speaking it from was. a man perspective right could it have just been that he was a horny teenager like it could have been a lot of things but that's taught hmm. that's taught unless it's in your, your bloodline. I feel like my, my dad has done so many years. He's back in prison for um, attempted murder. And I've done time. I don't know. If something comes anew every day. You know what I mean? So so when, when y'all did talk about it, mm -hmm. what was that conversation like? When I tell you that... Man. Hey, Marcus, you always give me... <laughs> give me a hug. <laughs> 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 you oh, know man. it's all love. Man. So, like I said, you know, um, because <laughs> I was always scared of him because he always had anger in him because he never felt a part of our family. He never lived with us. You know what I mean? Like, so I, he didn't live with y'all? No. Like, so how did how was he doing this stuff? Okay, so okay, let, let me break it down to you. When my mom was, she didn't want to keep the baby. So my grandmother was like, because there's only one boy and it's all girls. Mm -hmm. My grandmother said. You know, we're going to have a family meeting, and whatever that family meeting comes about, that's what's going to happen. Right. So my grandmother said, we're keeping them. Okay. And if you don't want them, I'm going to raise them. Okay. My grandmother is hardcore. She she was raising raised Old school. Style. She don't right, care. right. Man, she... So my brother didn't have a life. She, he, he was the man of the house. My, my uncle is the only boy. He, he was service and everything, you know? So my brother felt like it was taken from him. Do you understand what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, his childhood was taken from him. He felt less than. So when my mom passed, man, like, I know how I felt when my mom passed. So I wanted him to feel a part of. Do you mm. understand what I'm saying? So that's why I went to Montgomery. Like, sometimes he didn't even know I was coming. I was coming. I, I, like, sometimes I wanted to just pop up at his door with Kellogg's Corn Flakes because that's what we grew up on. You know what I mean? Like, <laughs> right. I wanted him to know that, you know, regardless of that, because, yo, he did give me closure. Because, listen, let me tell you something. As I walk through the valleys of the shadows of death, I fear no evil. And you said that in our first podcast. I sure podcast. did. <laughs> but, you know, when I looked at him, I was just like, yo, I'm not fearing no more. Because, I mean, he had a lot of rage and everything in him. And he was the point that, 
Yo, hurt people hurt people, and he was ready to hurt you. He right, brought, he was so brought you up was, in Trenton. Right, so you was maybe hesitant to say Man, something. Man, he was spitting my, I, yo, I see him. I don't know if he really spitting my food, but I know, like, when I pissed him off, he was doing some really fucked up shit. You know what I mean? <laughs> right. Um, I got my hands from him, because I, I, I would say some shit, and he'd give me body shots. But he was hurt. You know what I mean? But, man, I don't... <laughs> I don't even know, but I, I'm just so much about him. So, so real quick, I, I, I'm let's slow it down, right? Yeah. When y'all had that discussion, what was it like? Was he emotional? Was he, or yo, was he repentant about it? Was he, I it just, was he nonchalant about it? Like, what yo, was, what was the energy? So we're both Gemini's. Let me tell you that. So shout out to them Gemini's. Yeah. <laughs> so and it was dark in the room, and I was like, look, I know what you did to me, and he just looked at me, he paused. And immediately he cried and he said, that's not me. And I said, I forgive you. I love you. You know, I said, I don't know about the other accusations. I said that were made. He was like, never, never. And I believe What other him. accusations? I mean, I can't speak on somebody else's Okay, story. so he's got some other accusations going it, on? It, it, it never, nothing. I can't say whether it's not. I was about to say because if he was doing it to you, it could, but you know. You, I, listen, it didn't just end with my brother. I was humping my, you, you know what I mean? I opened the door. You know, it, like. So who else was, was you humping? I mean, I mean, not not like. Let it fly. Let mom, it fly. Man. Let it fly. Nah, but like you know how little, little cousins, like my my girl cousin, we get in the bed and we start touching. But we just got, man, it, 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 it was. So it was some cousin stuff yeah, going on. Yeah, man, in Jersey. Around there. In Jersey, okay, yeah, seven eighteen from okay, the side okay. there. But with and that these being, were your younger female cousins? We're all around the same age, but we were tight. We okay. were tight, you know what I mean? It, it, it definitely, but it, with, with my girl cousin, it wasn't never, nothing like, I never felt like anything evil. Even with my brother, like I said, I wanted to marry him. Do you understand? Like, and, I, and the reason why I stopped with your brother at 10 was because... My grandmother walked in. She walked in on y'all? She, she walked in. Having sex? Yeah, she, she walked in. She walked in. What? She walked in. What was her reaction? Okay, what could her reaction be? Bat shit I, going crazy, like. Nah, nah, we didn't even get a whooping, I don't believe. I what? think she's more hurt. I think, like, she didn't even know how to process that. Because how, like, how much she had felt like I kept him. Yeah. His father, you know what I yeah, mean? Like, yeah, 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 yeah. Like, it, when I tell you, like, this situation is so much deeper than what has happened to me. And, and, and. And you know what? Like, my brother gave me my closure. I need to find out what happened to him. So mm. I want to see if he will be a part of... So he didn't see your last interview? No. I mean, what do you think his thoughts are and his reactions are going to be when he sees it? I want him to be it. hurt. But I want him to know that when you said, if I would say what I forgive him, because I want him to know I have forgiven him. Like, I really have forgiven him. It's not about me no more. I could get so caught up in my trauma... That I can't help him. I can't even imagine what he felt not having a mom. Whatever happened to him, and in our household, he and not having about, a dad, not having exactly. a dad. And he's yo, you know? he's back with his dad today. So that's amazing. Who raped our mom? Mm. So listen, let me tell you something. That's some fucking strength. I I, I can't even take it. So mm. you know what I mean? And like I said, I never. So, like I said, there were accusations because there was never ever a said thing about him touching my girls or anything i've never even questioned it I, not you say touching your brother no, my girls my daughter oh your daughter right 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 i have my first daughter but when I was 13. that's not what the accusations are no it was like other cousins but okay you, know, you, you, you never know some people make false accusations too you got to make that clear i can dig it but i'm gonna yeah. be honest with you i mean if he was doing it to I, his sister it's, it's possible, possible that but that, then again too it's possible that he wasn't true enough there's, there's a could lot go of either way could Absolutely. go either way so but I okay. think, with that being said, I want to know what happened to him. I want to know why. So have him get in touch with me. I, I, I'm gonna. Believe me, I like Marcus. I just, I, I, I believe like anything that's used for your evil is gonna be made for your good. Absolutely. You better so, say that again. You better know it, man. I'm telling you. I'm telling so you. Mindset to over everything. Want to participate because he knows I'm out here homeless and like. Man, when I tell you God has showed his face, like my brother called me the other day, 5 o'clock in the morning, I'm sleeping on the concrete. He's like, sis, I just had you in my spirit. Go to the nearest hotel. I'm going to pay a week. And he's been holding me up. And he, and he got in touch with my other brother, and he was like, I told you, sis, that that's not true. And, da -da -da, and he's trying to, he's like, contact your brother. You know what I mean? Like, so there's some amazing things. It's not all about me. So I need my brother to get out his hurt and his pain because I don't want him to feel like he's not worthy. 
Mm. You know what I mean? And if he could fall, love his father who raped our mother, my nigga, let's do some amazing things. You know what I mean? Like, let's turn this evil or this hurtful situation yeah, into, into something uh, fucking beautiful. Yeah, man. And show the devil that he ain't never having victory. Oh, ever, wait. Ever in life. <laughs> I tell you what, man. man. I tell you what. I'm Listen, I'm excited to potentially hear from your brother. My Both my brothers. Yo, I want to. I want to. I want to talk yeah. to him. I want to yeah. fill this story out a little more, right? Yeah. So I, I guess. okay. Wow. Yeah. So yeah. all right. So yeah. I see we'll you. be on Jerry Springer. Oh, none of that. <laughs> I'll be on the market show. Hey, we but, on Atlanta Street interview. Yeah, I wanted to point out. I don't know who you were before, but you know, in my podcast, like so many people, you know, there was one person that said that you, you shouldn't have opened up that. Listen, let me tell you something. However. I get it out because the devil didn't want me to get it out in nope, the beginning. So yeah. did it. And I wasn't gonna do it with you. I get it out. Everybody wants to have a say in everything, even my team. Bro, let me tell you, I had my first child at 13, it takes from you. <laughs> Never mind anything I but if you wanna be a, a a solution to the problem, please help me. Do you understand what I'm saying? Like because right. the people in my life they're helping me. But I'm not ashamed today. It took me not having the teeth, because my mother always told me not to walk out the house any type of way. Don't let people talk about you. They talk about you anyway. Right. But guess what? Without no teeth, I love myself. And can't nobody take that from me. Yeah, man. You know what I mean? That's and the I'm first. So, that's the first thing you yo, got to do. And I'm so you can't. You can't love anybody else nah, properly until you love yourself. <laughs> I have. Yeah. I have. I have. And 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 man, when I tell you, God is showing His face in my situation. I'm in my fifth quarter in school. I'm like still holding on. I got A and B's. So you know what I mean? Like it's amazing. This is. I, it's amazing, man. Okay. I, see, Tia hasn't even came because so you're I'm you're up since the interview. <laughs> so you're 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 feeling uh, very hopeful. Oh, I know. And in an upward trajectory ever since the interview, basically. Absolutely. Well, you know what? I, it took me. <laughs> it took me. I Go was ahead, riding on the street train, um, the street train. Uh huh. And this kid was running up, and he was like, "Wait, hold on. You're on the street video." I'm like, "What?" He was like, "Yeah, I just seen you. I just watched it." And I, he was like, "You need to watch it. It's deep." And I did, and I wanted to say this. Thank you, thank you so much, because what you see is what you get. I'm not portraying to be anything, nothing at all, because I'm not lying to nobody, I'm lying to myself. Mm. I'm trying to heal, and with that being said, I'm trying to be a healer to other people. Hurt people hurt people. Also hurt people heal people. So it's you, very major for me to get my brother out here and just, you know, because everybody can look at him and be like, oh, why are you married there? This, that, 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 that. Listen, hold all that back. Hear the story to the end. Yeah. Please yep. keep your comments to the end. Yeah, because this is gonna be something so major. You know what I mean? And, and it's gonna change. You know, and, and and I'm ready for it. I'm just so welcoming to it. I tell you what, man. I tell hey, you what. Man. Listen, and let I'm me tell you something. And I'm gonna get my teeth fixed. So stop playing with me. Yeah, we ain't worried about that. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> worry about them folks in the nah, comments, man. But I'm, I'm gonna I tell you. About that. Most of them are very, very inspiring. When I tell you, like. Well, you're inspiring because man. when when you release. The truth like yes, this, truth it what it does is it inspires other people to do the same thing. And, and I, I get those messages all the time. Yes. People telling me, man, I saw this video. It it, 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 yes. it kind of inspired me to tell my family what happened to me. Yes. That type of deal. Yes. So you never know who you're touching by simply just sharing your story. Yeah, and I just, I'm just, you know, um, I love my brother. I forgive him. I don't know what he went through. I can't even imagine him not even having our mom. So anything that I could do to help him, like I'm gonna be there for him. I don't give a fuck what he's done to me. I forgive, my, I, I have forgiveness in my heart. And I'm gonna give him my right cheek, my left cheek, because it's teaching me humility. It's teaching me not to be so caught up in my trauma. You know what I mean? When I, when, when I get my degree, I, I'm never gonna forget what I've been through and where I, Man, I'm I'm here. It's only gonna it's only gonna add on to it. Yeah, I'm, it's only gonna I'm, add I'm on to it because general, you're gonna have the degree, but then you're also gonna have the life like, experience, yes, the yes, life experience. Yes, okay, yes, that yes. is so deep. So, yes. well, listen, we really appreciate you giving us this update, this surprise update. I was just walking by. And keep, All right. keep watching because my brother's gonna be here. I promise. You I cannot is. wait. I can't yeah, wait. So, listen, is. if anybody out there wanted to continue to reach out, help, or donate, is it the same information? Okay, so. It's a number, but it's not my number. So okay. it's 470-696-4872. I come up as never lose because I'm never losing. Okay. And don't fuck me up. Okay. <laughs>
Um, All right. Well, I'm so, going to put just the cash app, not the number, okay? Well, it, you, see, because when you put the cash I'm app... Put, I'm going to put the number in there and see what put, cash app pulls up. Yeah, yeah, It's my cash app. So okay, because I don't, want, I don't no, want nobody calling. No, it's not my number. Okay. It's just linked to that cash app. Okay, cool, cool, so, cool. So, you pay to put the number up there. Um, please help me to be better. Um, listen, let me tell you something. If, I'm not lying to nobody but myself. And today, I ain't lying to myself. That's right. It's all about truth. That's all it. about you. So please, please, please. <laughs> well, listen, we appreciate you and I definitely wish you nothing but the best, all right? I appreciate you, Marcus. You like, know you're it. changing lives out here. Hey, man, I'll I receive that, all right? I you make sure you have a good one, sweetie. Absolutely. <laughs>